Hey, what's up you guys? It's TPV 2012 number six. Let's get down to business. So today's question comes from someone who asked me, Panda, can being too promiscuous affect your life and how you commit in a relationship? So let's get this first out. What does being promiscuous mean? Being promiscuous means being characterized by or involving indiscriminate mingling or association, especially having sexual relations with a number of partners on a casual basis. So. Can being promiscuous affect your life and how you commit in a relationship? The answer is yes. Here's the thing. Say you're going out all the time. You're flirting with a lot of people. You go out, you start flirting with some guy, some girl, and then you start to kind of get a little, you know, closer. And then you start doing it with another person. And then another person and another person. Then you start dating one person. And then you start flirting with other people while you're dating. That's not good for a relationship. You can't commit because you want to try and be with other people because you're flirting with other people when you have a girlfriend or a boyfriend. It doesn't matter if you have someone and you think, you know, oh, I'm just flirty, it's just how I am. No, if you're with someone, you stop that flirting with other people and you start going and you hang out with your boyfriend or girlfriend, you spend time with them, you give them your time. You don't go out and you start spending time with other people that you want to try to be getting with. That's not how it works. You stick to who you're with because then all of a sudden you start flirting with all these, these people and then you're like, oh yeah, I really want to get married or I want to be able to do this with life. You can't get married or start dating someone if you have this life where you're going out and flirting with people, having sex with other people while you're dating someone. It doesn't work like that. So what if you think, oh, I'm just flirty? That's the big thing about it is a lot of people give off that I'm flirty excuse. There is no excuse about, oh, I'm just flirty when you're in a relationship. If you're just flirty, then be flirty with your boyfriend or your girlfriend. It's a simple fact. You can't go wrong when you're flirting with someone you're with because you're just giving them your love and affection and that's what you should be doing in a relationship. And how does it affect your life? Other people are gonna start looking down on you like you're some whore or slut and I hate to use those words, but the fact is that's how people will look upon you, especially for females because guys, they're like, oh yeah, I got with these guys. Yeah, but guess what? Then girls are gonna start looking at you like you're a player, and guess what? Being a player, it's not a cool thing. You think you're cool and like, oh yeah, I got with this girl this time and this girl this other time, guess what? Screw off, because players, they don't belong in this world. I used to be like that, where I'd go out and I'd hang out with all these girls and try to get with one girl and then flirt with another one and be like that. I was kind of a player, and that's not who I really am, and I knew that's not who I was inside, so I changed my life. I changed who I was as a person, especially when it came to dating. And I said, okay, I need to focus on one person. And if I'm dating someone, they get my attention. That's what it is. That's the greatest thing about being able to have a fully committed relationship is you are fully committing your heart and your love to that one person that you know you want to be with. I had to look at my life. I had to change my life and I had to start realizing that, look, I need to give someone my full attention and I eventually started doing that and I started to realize I had a lot better relationships by keeping my one focus on that person because when I committed and I stayed in that relationship with the one person life was easier my relationship was better so tell me guys how does being promiscuous affect your life and how you commit in a relationship are you promiscuous or are you not how about someone else you know let me know in a video response down below I'm also on Facebook Twitter and Google Plus I will see you guys Tuesday